Hey guys, it's me Rahul. I'm gonna start things off with a wallpaper app like always. This time it isn't an Unsplash wallpaper app but a really nice vibrant wallpaper app which also has some live wallpapers as well. Everything about this app is nice. There isn't any annoying ads on this app which is always a good sign. Yeah, I totally recommend this app. Ever picks to anyone who just want to up their wallpaper game. It is really hard for me to actually like a game that I would actually want to play. Grim Valor is the amazing game that I have played in a while. It is your typical hack and slash platformer game, but the great attention they have put into sound design and the overall aesthetics of the game is incredible. The controls are also very simple, it's really good, you guys should check it out, the first chapter of this game is free, so why not? I think I have not talked about this app yet, but this is a must have absolute gem of an app for Instagram users. It's a toolbox for your Instagram. This app has been on the Play Store for a long time. It is not a new app, but the reason why I brought this app in today's video is because it allows you to do something that was never possible on Android before. On Instagram, you couldn't make a collage of pictures on your story. It was impossible. You always had to use an extra app to make the collage and post it to your story. Now you don't have to do that with Gbox keyboard. It basically allows you to insert pictures to your story. It is a normal looking keyboard but with some additional options of course. Traffix is a game that is quite unique in terms of the mechanics and the gameplay. In this game, you take control of the traffic lights and you have to carefully switch on and off traffic lights to let vehicle pass through an intersection without making a mess or blocking vehicles for too long. It is a fairly simple game with amazing 2D animations. It's monsoon here so I don't really know when it's going to rain and an app like Happy Weather can really help me and you in this situation. It is a very minimal and different from other weather forecast apps that I have seen. It has dark mode which is always a welcome feature and if you pay a lit little bit extra, uh, it, the app is of course free, if you pay a little bit it also has some sweet widgets as well. Overall I like its simplicity. Drag racing games aren't my favorite but I like racing games like the Asphalt and the NFS series. Those games are really awesome and a lot of fun to play but I know for a fact that a lot of people love these drag racing games. They love the 1v1 races and you have to shift gears at the right time. It is more challenging than other racing games for sure. Top Speed 2 has everything that you want to see in a drag racing game. If you are a privacy freak, you have heard about Tor browser. There wasn't a Tor browser before for Android but, a, but they had a VPN, a Tor VPN for Android which works as you would expect. Finally they have a Tor browser which protects your privacy by hopping and routing your traffic through various Tor nodes. It also uh, has some neat features as well. It comes with two installed extensions, HTTPC Everywhere and NoScript. Both of those are very popular extensions among users. Pinball is one of the best arcade games that was ever invented. I loved playing the classic pinball game in Windows XP. I didn't know what I was doing back then, I was just smashing the keyboard hoping that I would get points. And if you want to relive that experience on your phone, then Space Pinball is probably the best one out there. It isn't a redesigned graphically intense pinball game but it is something that is very close to the original. Desire, a game which revolves around Desire, the lead character in this game. He is colorblind to the point where he can only see black and white. In this adventure point and click game, you need to help the lead character solve mysteries and go on an adventure. There are some concepts in this story that I'm sure a lot of people won't like. So if you're not easily offended or don't mind some things, if I say more, uh, I'm sure this video is gonna get demonetized just for saying that word. I don't want that to happen. Uh, other than that, uh, it's a slow paced game with a, with a lot of room for improvement. How many hours have you spent on Photoshop trying to perfect a selection? You don't have to do that now. AI Cut is an Android app which can automatically de detect which parts of the image is the object and which parts are the background. Then you can basically apply filters and things onto each of the layer. I think it's a really useful app to spice up your photos but I really want to see more options and features like exporting uh, the object only or the background only so we can actually import that uh, image to Photoshop and further adjust the image or uh, or they can provide more adjustment tools. So that's pretty much it guys. Hope you guys like this video. 
if you did give this video a big thumbs up and i'll talk to you guys in my next video goodbye